As the dominoes continue to fall in college football, the high school football season forges on, as do we with our pigskin previews. Anderson County football has spent the offseason working to replace four starters on the offensive line, along with their leading receiver and rusher from 2019. To be ATE's Kellyanne Stitz was at the Mavericks practice, where despite having some holes to fill, they believe this upcoming season could be a historic one for Anderson County. Anderson County head football coach David Gillum has high expectations and optimism for his team this season, saying this group has the potential to be the best they've ever been. In his 13th year at the helm, Gillum says they have about the most kids ever returning this season, making for a Mavericks team loaded with experience and deep with talent. We've always got to go out and earn it, but um, we feel like we could be better than we've ever been. We think this could be our year to get over the hump, get Greenville and Elizabeth Beston, and maybe win our first state championship. So we're um, very excited about this season. Um, we can't wait for it to take place. So we've been especially nervous with all this COVID talk because we do firmly believe this is our year, not just a rally cry that everybody makes. We, we think we're going to get it. Gillum says the team needs to continue to get in game shape and be able to execute at a high level on both sides of the ball. If the Mavericks are able to do that, the head coach believes this team has the potential to go all the way this season. Reporting from Anderson County High School, Kelly and Stitz, WATE 6 on your side. All right, thank you, Kellyanne. Week one, first high school football Friday, just 10 days out. Mavs will host Crosstown rival Clinton Dragons in week one. Madison.